Mr. Bass, we will complete our discussion by looking at titles for Nine Hours to Rama and Walk on the Wild Side. These titles appear to be a further extension of the medium. In these titles, I came to grips with what I think is the most challenging aspect of any creative endeavor. And that is to deal with ordinary things, things that we know so well that we've ceased to see them. Deal with them in a way that allows us to understand them again. In a sense, it's making the ordinary extraordinary. For instance, Nine Hours to Rama is about the nine hours which preceded the assassination of Mahatma Gandhi. By taking a clock, ordinary object, and subjecting it to an unrelenting examination, I hope to create an intensification of one's awareness of each moment. Walk on the wild side, I used a cat, a creature we probably stopped really seeing a long time ago. Now the challenge was how to restore our original view of a cat when it was new and strange, and to transform it into a pervasive presence which was at the same time faithful to Nelson Algren's story of New Orleans street life.
In recent years, you've been very active in other forms of filmmaking. Have you abandoned your work on titles? My work on titles was a marvelous opportunity to learn about filmmaking. I think I touched about every aspect of the process, both creative and technical. And I worked with many wonderful people. But there are always new challenges, new mountains to climb. I've since directed interior sequences for other people's features, short films, commercials, my own feature. But it's all film, and film is wonderful. I'm a filmmaker, and I intend to continue making films of all kinds, short or long, because there's nothing I'd rather do.